Hello Zebra Herd and welcome back to Splatoon 2. And today, we're gonna be going ahead and checking out yet another weapon. I hope that we can get a good amount of rank in tower control today as we check out today's weapon, because that's what we'll probably be doing. I don't know too much about this weapon, but I know it's been around for a while. It is the .52 gallon. I think it should be pretty fun. The 52 gallon is a heavy hitter with an extra large nozzle for shooting massive amounts of ink. It's powerful but slow, making it important to be aware of your uh, surroundings. Lucky for you, it comes with the point sensor sub. The, includer, the included baller is great for drawing attention, so I recommend this set to players who would like to control the flow of battle. So we'll try this out. I really don't know how well we'll do with it, but it might be fun. We'll be able to cover a lot of turf, which might be good for tower control. Um, but you know, if it doesn't turn out too well, if we lose a lot of rounds, we can always make our way back to, um, you know what it's called, tower, they're not tower, <laughs> turf war. But uh, for now, let's go ahead and grab a bite at the Crusty Strong Snack Shack. Uh, let's see what we can get. This will give us battle cash increased, battle cash doubled, that's crazy. Battle cash increased by 150%, I don't even have any of those. How do I get them then? Uh, no ticket in order, sorry, I don't make the rules. Actually, that's a lie, but you still gotta have a ticket. Okay, um, so yeah, we'll go ahead and just do the battle cash. I mean, we have so many of these though. Hmm. It says what, there's 20 remaining, but like, I don't know. I guess maybe, like it gives you, because I don't have 20 remaining. I only have one ticket, but what is remaining at 20? I guess like 20 battles with it? What does the drink menu have? Oh, look at this, I didn't know I had this. I don't have too many of these, but a special charge shake increases gear XP gain and slightly increases the change of the chance of receiving. Oh, okay, interesting. I didn't know that was, that was a thing. All right, we'll just go ahead and do the double one now. Sure, why not? Yum, yum, yum. Hey, peace, Quido. All right, so we got double coins coming in. Hopefully we can play well for the next 20 battles. If not, well, I just wasted it. But I think the best way to get tickets is to uh, do Salmon Run, if I'm not mistaken. Of course you can find some in story mode, but I don't think you find really the, the rarer ones in story mode. So uh, I'd love to hear, what is your best way to get more tickets? But uh, yeah, it looks like we have tower control here. It has Arowana Mall and Sheldendorf Institute, two maps I'm not incredibly familiar with, but we have played tower control on before, so we should be able to make it work okay. So let's hope everything turns out exactly that. It may or may not have taken me like 10 minutes to find a match, but we're finally here. The 52 gallon, it does definitely cover a lot of ink just from a couple of shots here. I'm thinking that its spotting ability won't be so impressive though, so I'm gonna try to stay back as much as we can, which is a very challenging thing to do on this map because there's sort of a lot of verticality where they can sort of sneak up on us. I will throw like one of these uh, finding bombs, but they're not really too helpful to be honest. So we might end up finding our way back to turf for some point in today's episode, but for now, I might as well go with this and see if I can't sneak up on somebody like you right here. You don't seem to find me or see me, so boom, do that. It didn't really actually do anything. That's fine, it's fine. It happens, it happens. Let me move this way then. And uh, if not anything else, fill up some turf to make it easier for us to survive and for them to not. Uh, for right now though, Oh, get you, get you, get you a little bit. At least a little bit, hey buddy. Okay, this is not good. Uh, I'll catch up with this then. Oh, hey, hey, wait, 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 it didn't work? It didn't work? Oh gosh. <laughs> that was like all kinds of awful, constantly. I just like couldn't explode it before they just popped it and then my fun was over. Okay, well, I'll go ahead and try to go from the above way like they have because it seems to be worthwhile to do this at times. Uh. Only problem is I don't really see where they are. They're over here now. Oh, hey, 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 hey. It is very difficult to get a splat with this thing. Um, I do see some people down there. I don't think I'm gonna be able to quite get to them. But if not anything else, you know, I could just try to be the person everybody teleports to. I got one person, then they got me. It happens, they used the, uh, the baller. What do you know? So far, this is not turning out very well. I do not think this is our uh, tower control kind of uh, weapon. But I don't know, since I haven't asked you guys, what are your thoughts on 52 gallon? Do you use it? What kind of game modes do you use it with? Do you have any tips for me? I would love to hear them, so thank you so much. Oh boy, I can't quite get this guy from here, but I can get them in general, right? Right, where are you running to, huh? Where are you running to? Where are you running to? Can I really not get you? Am I really that bad at everything? Move it. Wait, did I run into him again? What the? <laughs> I didn't think he was hiding in that one little puddle, but he was. He was indeed. Man, this has actually been quite the intense one, though. We keep uh, going back and forth with this tower. I need to go ahead and rely a little bit more on my superpower if I can manage, which isn't too bad to do. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. 
Yeah, this thing is not good for splatting so far. Maybe it's just me, maybe it's my aiming, I'm used to the, the, the franticness of the splat duelies, but so far, I am really not nailing this. Okay, so let's just be careful of all the superpowers that are flying every which way, and none of them are from our team. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, hey! <laughs> You're very good at that, aren't you? Aye, aye, aye. Yeah, this is, I don't know if this is gonna turn out very well, so we'll try a couple rounds. If we could at least win this one, that'd make me happy. We'll have to see. Uh, right now it's a bit of a struggle, at the least. There is somebody up here, so if we could end their fun a little bit, there you go. Come on, oh, hey, hey, another one! <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> he had a friend! Okay, uh, somehow I survived all of that, and we took the tower. That sounds like Christmas morning. Okay, uh, let me toss that like over here. It looks like I did catch a couple people, but am I actually going to be able to splat them? Uh, almost. It just does not do much damage. Can you stop it? <laughs> I'm like covering up when he's uncovered and it's like, oh, come on. I need to use a superpower sooner or later. It's just not really finding good situations where I probably should roll in with it, especially since a lot of the people will be on top of the tower where the blast, I don't think, will reach them. So right now, I'll cover this stuff up. It seems like they're trying to recover it. But for right now, this is moving this way. I'm gonna roll over here, because it seems like my teammate could use an extra hand. There you go. Too bad I don't have hands, I have hooves. Move it, move it. Oh boy. Where did that person go? I have no clue. But hey, I like being the guy that everybody can just teleport to. That's fine with me. Plenty good strategy. Let's get back up here, start controlling this as much as we can. And that wasn't very much. Man, just everybody controlling the uphill right at the perfect time is a little bit tough for me. I mean, I wanna be able to win this so we can get the A rank, but I just don't know if that's gonna happen at this point. All right, so they took the tower. I'm definitely gonna try to, whoop, up here, and then try to not do that! Exactly that was what I was trying not to do, and then I just go ahead and do it. Ugh. All right, come on, move it, move it, move it. I know this thing's about to end. Come on, start back up again. Oh, I see you. Oh, I see you. Never mind. Oh, uh, come on, my range. Should be good, but not good enough. That is a very long range. Crack on splat roller. I have not tried that yet. I'll have to try that soon. The range seemed very nice. I think they might take it from us here, and they're moving all right. Um, actually, no, it's actually settling back to the center. If we don't take it, though, we are going to lose, so we need to go out over there as much as we possibly can and uh, take that tower. Come on, come on. I just need to help in any way possible, which was not really too much there. But yeah, we're gonna move back to turf after this. Not really a good idea with this weapon. <laughs> <laughs> yep, we just lost. Oh man, so yeah, this thing looks like it's very good for covering turf, very, very not good for splatting. So we'll need to stay back, lob the ink from any way we can in turf four. All right, so turf four, maybe this will work out a little bit better for me, huh? I can only hope. We'll try to get out there as soon as we can, if not anything for, but for the benefit of our teammates. I do like the range on it, you really can start covering turf from a fair distance, which is good. Like I can get like that stuff up there without too much of a hassle. I see you up there, buddy. I actually wasn't able to get you, look at me. <laughs> all right, so far taking some good situations. This guy was all over the place. Come on, come on, come on, be careful. Let me fill up on some ink. But I'm just able to keep people at a comfortable distance pretty well. And I feel like that's something you need to keep on doing. And then once things maybe seem like they're not in such a good spot, I can do that, but do it better next time. Might be uh, a better idea. Oh, get this person. Okay, I got them, they got me. A little bit of a balance there. And we're mostly taken out right now, so this is not so good. But we can do it. Let's do some janitor duty. Now that we've gotten some paths out there for the rest of our team teammates, I think it'll be good to uh, just fill things up here around. Just like that, but the range is great. I feel like that's sort of the biggest perk to this weapon right now, is that it's a weapon that shoots fairly quick enough, and it has a uh, good range. You know, of course you trade that for being pretty vulnerable when people just close that distance on you, but if you can take the advantage, it's great. And then this counts as points up here. There are enemies everywhere. They have a very strong control of the area right now. Let me fill up on, ah, where, where were you? <laughs> oh, he's a ninja, didn't even see him. He's just like, he was there and he wasn't. What the heck? <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, let's fill up as much as I possibly can. I know there are some evil, evil enemies right now on our doorstep. This is not a good thing going on right now. We'll have to make a big turnaround if we want to win this now. Okay, so I see this dude down here. Didn't really even have to do much about him. Just trying to cover up that turf. Nobody's over here, luckily. Can I make a super jump over? Not exactly, but I tried. Come on, come on, get rid of this dude. I helped, I helped. Help with this guy as well. Okay, I did help. 
fill up. I just need to fill up everything I possibly can, wherever I can. So let's get over here and get this stuff. We had a pretty decent start, I think. And then things fell apart really, really quick. So I think there is somebody coming around somewhere. So I'm gonna try to, oh, boom. That didn't get him. Okay, let's keep moving. Because I don't wanna be in a situation where that person realizes what I was trying to do. Yeah, I got him. Okay, try to take care of this person over here because I don't think they'll have too much of a clue unless their friend is hanging out. This is not good. This is not good at all. Maybe this is just an episode where we lose every single time. Well, we can't give up hope yet. We have a whole 25 seconds. That's gotta be enough time for something, right? Uh, maybe not. Come on, fill it up. Because we are just trying to defend our base here, not even trying to get out there and cover real amounts of turf. Oh, and I didn't even see him. I don't know. I'm still a little on the fence if I like this weapon or not, if it's really worthwhile. But I don't know. Maybe I'm not using it correctly. Maybe it just isn't the right situation. I need to keep that constant control because it seems like once you lose that control with a weapon like this, it is very hard to get it back. It seems like we got a good start, we got a couple spots, and we were able to keep everybody at a distance, sort of keep them cornered into their side, we would have been fine. But once they take control, that just didn't feel like I could do anything. Oh wow, two of our play, okay. This one didn't count then. <laughs> this round did not count for anything about this weapon. I thought that that was in a situation where we had an entire team on our side. Not the case, so I'll hold all my judgments until we get a proper game of Turf War and see if we can't win that. That was silly, that was really silly, because I, we were doing fine and then two of them disconnect? I can't imagine they were both rage quits then. If we were doing fine, it would be very silly, unbased rage quits then. I think maybe they just both happened to disconnect, maybe they were actually playing together, but even though it was it's solo play, so I don't think you can, I don't know. I don't know one bit. All I know is that I've bought double coins and I've lost 100% of the games I've had with double coins so far, so life is treating me well. Oh well, well, we have our uh, teammates now. Seems like everything is good and ready to go. Hopefully, wow, there are some very high level people. Level 54 was like the highest level. I think you can actually go past level 100 and then you, you like start again, but you have a little star next to your name, which is pretty cool. I mean, the only reason I wanna level up is to unlock all of the weapons. So there isn't too much of a reward for me after that unless it like gives you coins for every level up after that or something. Anyways, Blackberry Skate Park should be fun. It's gonna fill up as much as I can, use you know this great range to my advantage, like I've said before. Speaking of great range, <laughs> gotta be careful. Uh, let's move up this way, because it looks like uh, most of our teammates were able to get this spot covered, which is great. Uh, well, well, they're trying to change that right now. Oh, I got him, nice. It really is, if I wanna get any kind of splash with this weapon, it feels like it has to be very tactical. You have to really know where the enemy is, and you know, try to be very careful. I'm gonna explode right here. It won't be getting anybody, but it'll be covering up turf, which is good. Trying to be very afraid of that sniper guy. Okay, run. Turn back around. Okay, now I gotta be very careful. We could get back up here, maybe. <laughs> Hello, um, I am just a sloppy mess right now. Come on, come on, come on. I know he's right here. There were like three of them next to me. So what could I have really done? I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this weapon. I really don't know. It can be great for covering turf, but at the same time, I just feel like there's so many better options that also keep me protected. Like, like this is great because they didn't even see me. But beyond that, it's just like, I don't know. And maybe if I was a little bit more accurate, maybe that's sort of where my problem is, I'm just not accurate enough for a weapon like this just yet. And I feel like this one, I think this one's been around since the original Splatoon, it's been around for a while, and I've definitely gotten spotted by, by a fair share of 52 gallon users, but, oh hey, okay, so that wasn't too bad. Where I land, a situation where I can land every single shot, things turn out okay, but, you know, how often am I gonna get that situation? Not too often, because I'm not that good at the game. So I don't know. For that, I don't know, I, I feel like it is, uh. Maybe a higher skill bracket weapon? But who knows? I gotta keep trying it out. And it might just also be a matter of me just having to get used to it. I'm trying to hit this guy without him hitting me, and it finally worked. <laughs> okay, where is this dude? There was a guy over here. He looks like my teammates took it up. It is quite easy to earn up a super with this, which is good. I can't believe that hit me. Cannot believe. <laughs> so far though, we are holding our own. We are actually starting to push back here. I'm gonna keep over this way though. Like I know a lot of our teammates are out there. Two of them just got spotted, which is a huge issue, but that's why I didn't want to jump over there. I feel like getting into the fray, once again, is not something you want with this weapon. You want to be able to stay back and have maximum amount of controls. If people end up teleporting to me, great stuff. But uh, 
A lot of the time, that's not gonna turn out the way I want it to. Getting stuck into a corner like that is definitely also not gonna work. Okay, this is gonna be a huge problem. I need to get out there and just basically cover as much turf as possible. I do find it weird that a weapon like this does not have a turf focused uh, thing. It has, you know, the seeking missile, which can be great if you're, you know, with your teammates and if you're maybe just trying to find a way to stay away from the enemies long enough that you can just continue to splat. For now, though, I'm just gonna cover up turf. Go, 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 go. Oh boy. Wait, don't you dare. Don't you dare, sir. I would have gotten splatted there for sure, but I didn't, so that's good. Did we win? That's a more important question. I don't know where they were, but it looks like I actually was able to make up a good amount of ground. Maybe enough to win. Yeah, okay, 53 to 38. We get our first victory of the day. Better than nothing, that's for sure. Luckily, none of our teammates disconnected either, so we got ourselves five splats, which really isn't too bad. 1,600 points, almost 1,700. I feel like that could have been better. But uh, we get plenty of coins, plenty of coins. Let's see if we can't climb our way back to like 50,000 coins. Probably not in today's episode, but before the double coins run out, I would really hope so. All right, back on the skate park. I'm not doing anything else but skating today, apparently. That's fine, I'll have fun, fun with it. Okay, so let's move with it. We have the bright yellow color this time, which I think actually complements the sunny, sunny area pretty nicely. I like it. We're going against blue. Hmm. Right now, I'm just trying to be careful. I'm trying to cover whatever turf I can without it being too overbearing. I don't want to go too far out because it would definitely be a huge risk. There definitely is a blue player around here somewhere. Hmm, not exactly sure where, so let me fill up an ink. I'm playing it slower this time. I really just want to be careful, but also I need to not be, you know, too slow or they'll just catch up to me and beat me up. Oh gosh, I fell. <laughs> Maybe that, like, that's a time too slow. I gotta be. Smarter and quicker than that. Oh, okay, okay. They could have gotten me in a bad spot there, but they did not. So far, we're really holding them back in their base. Things are turning out quite well. I'm gonna explode right here while I rolled off. Still getting used to the roller superpower, for sure. Our teammates seeming to be in a good position, like playing well, is also helping a ton. I just like how we can get a lot of high ground control just because of how far this thing can shoot up. It's just easier to cover those like pieces of turf we can't even see or reach. So that's good. Let's get up here. and. And I'm just gonna keep with the high ground. When we do get the high ground, it's even better. So, good stuff. Try to get this guy over there. Like, I don't know exactly where he is, but I know enough to throw that bomb over that way. Oh, hey, hello, sir. Leave me alone, please, leave me alone. Oh my gosh, my aim is so bad. If I could have just held on for an extra second, that roller would have just went right through him. Okay, so who's running right now? There was an enemy over here who seemed to mess up our plans. I saw them going over that way. No! Don't tell me the connection's unstable, that's silly. Who just disconnected? The, the entire enemy team just got taken out, apparently? I don't wanna deal with any of that. The connection is not unstable, you hear me? I have no clue what's going on anymore. I think half the team is disconnected. Ah, oh, that's the worst. I hate it when that kind of stuff happens. Yeah, they're not moving. Uh, one minute left, and nothing's happening here then. I mean, I might as well try to get a wicked high score, but uh, I don't think anybody's actually here, because nobody's respawning or anything. Ah, oh, man, I don't like that one bit. Why? I mean, is it my connection? Is it the enemy's connection? Seems like they've totally given up. Yep, a communication error. Why? <laughs> my internet's fine. Look at that, I'll just refresh a web page on my computer. See, for myself. Let's see, there's a refresh. Yeah, a refresh, everything's fine. A lost platoon's fall. All right, it might not be. It might be there's a lot of our team that's somehow disconnected or something weird like that. I feel like we were gearing up to probably win that one we had them pushed into their base. Luckily, it wasn't a loss. I would hope it wouldn't account for the, um, the ticket that we used at the beginning of today's episode, but it might, and if so, well, there's not much I can do about it, oh well. All right, let's, let's find a battle. Thank you, as soon as I say that. Maybe we could do some Starfish main stage. We really haven't done that map too much. We only did it, well, we did it once and we lost, but uh, maybe we can win this time. That'd be much better. We just need one more person. So, hurry right, up, find a person. Yeah, I think it actually did count that one. How silly is that? Like, that's not out of, that's just out of my control. Win or lose, I didn't get either. Uh, but yeah, we have 16 more tries to get a bunch of coins. I'm hoping we can hit 50K with all that, but I'm not really sure. Okay, back on Blackberry Skate, the Blackberry, no, Black Belly Skate Park. It'd be, it'd be nice of those blackberries. I just give you free blackberries. Okay, free free fruit for everybody who skates under skate park. Stay healthy out there. I thought that'd be a great promotional campaign. 
All right, we gotta be careful here. But I can also toss that that way. It seems like there were some enemies going around here. I gotta be very careful of just like that. Okay, where are you now, huh? You're over there. You know exactly where I am, which is a problem. Um, I'm, that actually got me? <laughs> okay, you can have that one. I'm surprised that actually got me. Man, okay. Well, not a good start. This is basically the opposite of last round, which is great because the game wants to disconnect me when we have good starts. Why? Why? That was all me, I guess. I should have stayed on the upground, but I didn't think they were gonna wrap around the corner like that. I think I didn't even notice them until they were already, I was already down there. Ugh, I don't know how I feel about this weapon. Like, I don't think it's a bad one. I just simply don't think I'm gonna be playing with this one. I feel like if I'm just gonna be covering turf, there are just way better options. Like, why not just pick up the arrow spray or even just a splatter shot? Hey, okay, that person just sort of jumped out of nowhere. I feel like there definitely is still some more lag. I don't know, maybe they're like updating the servers at the moment or something, and they get stuck in a corner like this. Like, what can you do? Apparently get the spot still, but I thought like that was just both of us playing bad. Let's get up here, just like that. Fill all this up as much as I can. The superpower definitely makes it a little bit more of a deadly combo, but at the same time, it's just like, oh, it's not enough. Okay, so, let's try to chase this guy down. I don't think he quite sees me. Oh gosh, come on, be careful, be careful. I know you're chasing me and I don't appreciate it, so I'm gonna try to get away from you. Oh, there we go, see that's where it's good. If I could just remember that I have sort of, most of the time, unless I'm going against like a specific sniper character, I usually have some kind of range advantage. Like I don't up here on the upground, sometimes. But there are sometimes I do, it really depends. I'm stuck, okay, not good. They are really controlling us right now though. Like we can't do much about this. Can we just get the one guy that's in our spawn though? That'd be good. All right. Try to get some of this stuff, move back this way. Come on, come on guys, we can do it. I believe in us. Oh, hey, I see you. I got you, you got me. Ha ha ha. Well, they got their area very well covered. Um, yeah, it's about even right now though. We could make this work, but they're, they're, they have like, you know, little bits of mess everywhere that is on our side, which is not gonna help us with taking over and getting the win. Is there any enemy up here? There's not, good. So from here, like getting the high point seems to be a very good thing with this weapon. Being able to control the high ground because we just are able to reach a bunch of spots. Um, I can't outrange a roller though, which is a shame. Uh, you know what, all right. Come on, boom, that got nobody. I haven't gotten like a single spot with that thing, I don't think. Maybe I got a spot there, it was hard to tell. Oh, I got taken out. They have somebody just jamming out at our spawns. The chances of us winning are incredibly low now. Come on, can I just get like one shot out? Nope. Not at all, I hate when I get spotted right at a perfect time where it's like, okay, you're done for the game. You can't do anything more. Yep, we didn't win that one. Man, I don't know how to feel about this weapon. I'm like very torn. We'll do one more round on it, but I just feel like it's definitely not for me at the very least. I just feel like it's not effective for what it's trying to do. If that had maybe slightly better fire rate, that could, I feel like, improve it, but Mm, I just feel like, why wouldn't I just do arrow spray or something like that? But maybe that's always my answer. Why not just do arrow spray? Okay, we'll get one more game in. Hopefully it'll be at Starfish main stage. See if we can't get a victory on there instead. But definitely I feel like this is a turf war weapon. It's supposed to be for covering turf. I feel like it's definitely been a fun weapon on stuff like Salmonarn. I'm pretty sure I've tried it on Salmonarn before. Being able to take care of a ton of little fishies, that's always fun. Being able to get a group of smaller enemies. Obviously, you're not gonna run into that situation online against other players, so. I don't know. I don't know at all. But we're just gonna try one more round, see if it turns out any better. We're on the skate park again. That's all we got. Okay, that's fine. We'll have some fun. At the least, we'll have some good fun. Okay, so we're going against a lot of splatting potential there. I mean, we do have a decent amount. Looks like we have one of the, the Sploosh-O-Matic, I think, and then two Duelies, and then we have me. <laughs> and then they have a Roller, two and Zappity Nines, and then also a sploosh -O I don't know what the sploosh -O like. I think that's one of the ones I plan on purchasing soon. Ooh, can I get some good aim there? Thank you. That was great. That's a good start right there. A good spot to start off with pretty early in, and then I can go with the Roller and then get about here. They don't seem to notice me, so I won't be able to get them because my awful, awful aim. Wow, they just turned around and mopped me. I mean, that's sort of the thing is that I can't 1v1. Unless I'm at a range, like I saw with the first spot of the, the round, I was on enough of a range that they just couldn't get me. I was on an advantage. But without a considerable advantage, it's very hard to get a splat. Gotcha, okay, just barely got you too. There are some missiles heading my way, so I'm just gonna back up. 
We'll just try to see how good of a score we can get this time. Can we break a thousand points? I don't think we've done that at all today's episode, so getting a thousand points would be pretty good. I'm just trying to use everything I've learned with weapon for this last final round. Okay, so right now they've been using a lot of missiles. I think there's like at least two people on their team. I think both, you know, the NZAP 85 players probably, yeah, have missiles at the least, so. Let's try to get over there and, you know, scare this guy off a little bit, but he can definitely outreach me, or at least equal my reach, I think. All right, I need to fill up. Let's get up here. I'm just trying to clean up whatever I can. It can be tough to clean up. Oh boy, come on, come on, come on. Stop, don't get stuck against the camera. All right, so I think my best bet here is to jump at him and then just go for it. Ready? Boom. He isn't around here, but at the least, you know, I'm okay. Whoa, Autobomb! <laughs> gotta move, gotta move, gotta move. Where is this dude? He's over there. Teammate took care of him. Thank you, teammate. Okay, so I don't even wanna look at who's winning right now. I just wanna be able to focus on, you know, doing what I can. Come on, come on, don't, don't make that awful. I probably could've gotten the splat right there. I think he's waiting for me to show up. Oh yes, he is. Oh, the best I can do at the moment is just counter turf it. Like, stay back, cover the turf. Um, I could throw this right here. Once again, that's a good idea to do. But I haven't really been imploring too much. Come on, come on, please don't let him get me here. Because I can get him, yeah, there we go. The larger range definitely helps for situations where they think they want you want to be able to get them, but you can, and they sort of think the same thing. Hey, boom, didn't get anybody with that. He just kept running. He's like not even dealing with me. Well, I'll, I'll splat you then. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I think he can out turf me here, so I need to go get him from a distance, and I failed. We are sort of kind of competing for it. This guy out here is a very good one to have. Come on, come on, come on. Can I jump to that dude? Oh, he's actually competing a little bit, so he might have just gotten taken out. Oh boy, problems, problems everywhere. Come on, oh, don't you dare, don't you dare, I'm out of here, I'm covering turf and that's it, You're that's final. Uh, got him, turn around, keep covering this stuff. Oh, okay, good last couple seconds there for sure. If not anything else, but I still don't think we won. Still don't think we won. It's gonna be close. Ah, actually not close at all, 10%. Whenever I think it's gonna be close, it's never close. But hey, we lost, they won. I don't know, I don't think this is gonna be a weapon I plan on playing a lot. If I didn't mess up a couple times for Z in there, I might have been able to get a thousand points, but I really have to push myself to get it. So I just don't see this weapon much in my future. Maybe if you guys give me some really awesome tips for it, I can learn some better strategies, some different ideas to have while playing it, but as of right now, don't know how I feel about this one. One of the few weapons where I'm just not really big on it for it just being a weapon in general. Not that it's not good for me and that I can recognize it's a good weapon. I just don't really see this one being as useful as just other things that can do sort of the same thing. But maybe I'm totally wrong, full of baloney, and you'll tell me what for in the comment section. I'd love to hear it. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Splatoon 2. If I just put a video, make sure you comment Zebra Gallon so you've watched at the end that you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.